Hi, this is attorney Mike Gravel. I'm coming to you from Chicago as usual. And today we're going to take another look at the Sovereign Citizens. This time it's going to be Sovereign Citizen Traffic Fail number 20. Let's do it. Uh, the cops just pulled us over right outside of our house. Okay, this one has a little twist to it, and it is absolutely luscious. Uh, we've got a sovereign citizen, a more sovereign citizen wannabe in the uh, driver's seat, but he's got his wife or girlfriend and his baby in the car, and she is not on board with this plan. Not at all. And don't forget to hit like and subscribe, or the dogs get it. As soon as we pulled up to the house, we got our baby in the car. So, they getting out. I'm coming. How may I help you, officer? You may help me by giving you license, registration, and before we please. before we get there, I need you to give me your badge number. I'm I'm recording for my okay, protection. Where fine. where's your body camera? At? I don't have a body camera. Okay, so. I need your my badge number. I is need three four two zero three four two zero. I need your name and I need your bond claim number. <laughs> oh, here we go. I need your name, your badge number, and a new one on me, your bond claim number. I don't even know if that's a real thing or not. I mean, they may have that. They, they may not. But uh, this guy's demanding it. Okay. Um, License, registration, insurance. I need. I will identify myself. Okay. I need you to identify yourself first. I'm Officer Kincaid, badge number 3420. Bond claim number, please. License, registration, insurance, please. Bond claim number. All right, sir. Excuse me. Can you give him your license, registration, he has to and insurance? Right, we have listen. our child in the car. I'm not doing it. Okay. Don't make this any more difficult than it needs to be. And we're right outside of our home. We okay. live right there. License, registration, insurance. Don't do it with my kid in the car. I'm not doing this. You can stand up for yourself another time. No. <laughs> I absolutely love it. You can stand up for yourself another time. And she's absolutely right. Uh, even that is indulging him to the extent that, that she's implying that he has to stand up for himself. I mean, he, he, he got pulled over for a valid reason. And... Uh, and he just needs to comply is what he needs to do. With my kid in the car. Yeah, right. You stupid. You black. Give up the ID, the registration, whatever. I actually don't have to identify myself. Well, you do, or you can you go to jail. I'm not doing this. Why are you pulling me over? You have your center brake light out, sir. What's the center brake light? The center brake light is that brake light right in there. And if you left something in the house, they can escort me in the air so I can get it. If, if there's going to be any more problems, I'm going to request... He, um, he's sure letting you know that you, your, your light's out, so say thank you. Man, I'm I not doing this with my kid in the car. Oh, is that refreshing. She is just the voice of reason, and she's telling him the way it is. Identify yourself and he gave you his badge number and all you can do. What the fuck is a bond? He probably don't even know what a bond plane number he is. Know what a bond, they, they're binded. They're, all them cops are bonded. <laughs> he doesn't even know what a bond number is. Okay, but okay, check your attitude. Because as soon as you, they pulled you over, you straight had an attitude from John. Cause you, 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 you send a brake light out. They ain't even talk to you all crazy. You start talking to them all crazy. Right, you could do that shit when you get pulled over by yourself, not with my kid in the car. Yeah, go ahead with your uh, crazy Morris off sit stuff when I'm not in the car. Stay here and watch them children. Driver's license, registration, insurance. 
Because you want, I'm traveling. <laughs> that well. All they know is if you don't comply. Excuse me, officer. Yes, I'm not going to My daughter has a G2 and a heart problem. I have to get her back home to her heart monitor. You know how long it's going to be? Because we live right here in the house. Oh, that's Sir, I have some bad news for you. Your vehicle registration expired May 31st. Okay? According to the laws of Philadelphia, I have to live stop the vehicle. Which means it's going to be towed by the Philadelphia Parking Authority. <laughs> In addition to that, I don't know what you're talking about with this bond number. Yeah, for registration. I need those keys for me, sir. Yeah, I need Okay, that's fine. But I'm still going to need those keys. I need All right. This whole video is just a gem. I, I mean, I really like this officer. He is having none of this whatsoever. I, the, you know, asking him when he went to law school is just beautiful. Okay, so you want a supervisor? I'm gonna need those keys. Once you, once you give me the keys, I'll call for the supervisor. I'll need your supervisor. All right, sir. It's not gonna end well. I'm gonna let you know that right now. You can't take my car. I can take your car. I have to take not your car. Registered to the state. It is registered to the state. I'm gonna un Yo, man, you Sir. Can't take my car, man. Sir. Look at my sovereign citizen husband. Uh or more. <laughs> Well, I guess they are married, so that, that's his wife, and she is not happy. I love it. She, she she goes back to the house, puts the camera on, and mocks him for a little while, which he deserves. Well, he want to be a more citizen. He have a right to travel. He ain't got to re-register re his car, and it only costs $70? You're just on here making this YouTube shit, talking about you cannot register your car. Here come the tow truck to impound that shit. Talking about you ain't got to register your car. You have a right to travel and all of this crazy. And you ain't got to pay bills or do nothing like that. Look, they impounding his shit. Thanks a lot, honey. We can't make it to our daughter's doctor's appointments. You can't go to work. You can't do shit because you trying to be a more citizen. And look, the cops is impounding you. So first the car, next thing it'll be the house and your credit score drop. Thanks a lot, more citizens. You fucked up my life. <laughs> Well put. Well, I did have to clean things up a little bit, but not too much. There was, I was just trying to make it uh, sort of viewer friendly for a wider audience, but uh, I did a little cleaning up, but she's absolutely right. In fact, I think she is, is a candidate for the Sovereign Citizen Patrol Hall of Fame, along with the police officer in this video. Here at Law Talk, we do a lot of videos answering common legal questions. We also do reviews of law in the movies and then on TV. We also share some of our more interesting cases. We're always putting out new videos. So if you like that, please hit like, subscribe, and ring the bell.